y'all downtown except to drive through, so we thought we'd do a little walk. See what it's like since the bombing. Just, just see, yeah, all that. Yeah, here, here comes the cops. Oh boy, they're after him. This right here is the Davidson County Courthouse. And City Hall. And City Hall. City Hall. Um, well, all those offices that you know you, you may want to go to or don't really want to go to, you don't want to go to are in there. That's not the place you want to go. <laughs> That's not the place. The jail is somewhere around there. Oh, we just washed it. Okay. Let's go down third. That way. We see we're gonna pick the sunniest. Okay. Well, they're all got sun coming down. Do you have a visor for that? This side. A visor for the kid. No. I need sunglasses for it. This so you this can't is even. This Church Street. And yeah, you can see it over there. That building's all boarded up on second. You can't. You can't even get to, yeah. But oh my God, the damage it did to that, and that's oh my gosh, if you, on the back side. Yeah, we're trying to see. Yeah, we haven't been down here since uh, since that crazy bomber thing. Yeah. But you, you know, just from what we can see, you can't really see from the camera, but what we can yeah. see is it's damage is pretty. Oh, it, is this the candy store? No, that's not the candy store. Oh. Candy yeah. store's over on second. You can't you can't oh. get to it. I don't think. I don't even know if it's back yeah. in business yet. I mean, it's this is Printer's Alley. You can see Printer's Alley right there. Yeah, I mean, it blew stuff out three yeah. blocks away. And um, I love all the art on the buildings down here. It's pretty neat. And I'm always on the wrong side. Aren't I? Yeah. So the way it looks, you cannot get to any businesses that were on second. I mean, all the roads. Yeah, that all, second avenue you see right down there. With all the buildings, windows with boards in them, and mm -hmm. the bomb actually went up off uh, to the left of what you see. Mm -hmm. The left up on second, and it just blew buildings. Yeah. Blew if them if down. you can see the street sign here, it says Commerce. Um, I don't know if you can see that, but it it blew it it actually happened probably right below that flag you see it was a little further up so we're, we're on um, park there no. this is broadway we're coming up on down here yes we'll find us a parking we'll find us a park parking place and then we're gonna get out and walk I'll, I'll crack the window just a little bit so you can Fans are already flying full tilt. Really loud. We're at Fifth and Broadway. Um, there's a lot of new construction downtown, as you can see here, where all the honky tonk row is. And there's the new music. Oh, oh yeah, that's the Bridgestone. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, Bridgestone Arena. Predators play there. Across the street is a new museum. It's National Music. Museum of American, African American Museum. It's pretty neat. I haven't been in there yet, but I heard it's really So neat. it's open? I don't know if it's open, but I knew somebody did went like a walk through and they said it's pretty neat. So, mm -hmm. of course, I can see the roof of the Ryman Auditorium right now. Oh, yeah, you can see it right, right there. And the Batman building. This is uh, this Bridgestone Arena here. We both work many events here, award shows and Yeah, I did the concerts. CMA Awards here and something else. Mm -hmm. And this is, of course, it's where this is Smashville. Yeah. For all you predators and hockey fans, this is where this it happens. This is where it happens. That building down there, you see, 
the you know the hall of fame the, is it right there yeah that's it that's right a, there it has a little curve too country music hall of fame and we're going to do a video there yeah. eventually but not today not today we're just going to take you a walk through honky tonk row here or the on broadway yeah. and see what's going on of course there's the rhyming up there on fifth you can see the beautiful uh, rhyming on tour I guess we better walk. It's got my. Well, okay. It's the one up there. Rippy's barbecue hockey. I hear that they have good ribs. Oh, uh, Nick, the guy I work with, his girlfriend works here. Who? Nick, one of the guys I work with, his girlfriend works here, and she got lunch for everybody at work today. Was it good? I wasn't there. I wasn't there. <laughs> Rippies here in Nashville, good place to be. Yeah. That's it. Rippies. Yeah, they got lots of good stuff. Reasonable prices. Mellow Munster. That's new here. That's a new Mellow Munster. And I've played in there. This is Alan Jackson's 5 o'clock summer bar. I've played in there with Vince Real a few times. can see these are just little bitty stages uh, but everybody fits up on there <laughs> they have a good time there's Nashville Crossroads bar yes. I played in there every was it every Thursday night we played gosh I can't I think so it was every there. Monday night the place will be packed out yeah uh, it's been me Gates Becker Mark Beckett Little yeah. tiny stage. Another little tiny stage. Yeah, you can see right there. It's the place would be packed out. Yeah. Played lots of really good music in there. It was a lot of fun. Yeah. Of course, all these places don't open till later. Yeah. Most of them. There's a few, few places across the street. Ernest Tub Record Shop. Ernie Tubbs. Ernest. Ernest Tub Record Shop. Um, This, this place here was used to be something else. You know, two or three years ago when I was playing down here a lot, and they had the best cheeseburger. This right here? Yeah. Paradise Bar. Yeah. It's very nice bar. Yeah. It still is. That place so, is a good place to get a burger if you're over here. This is a downtown sporting club. World famous duty talking about. Yeah, they already have fans playing with him.
another oh, one of his, uh, yeah. This is Betty Goods, I guess? Yeah, that's like going into a, that's a beautiful track. Well, this is where I need to come, I want to get me some boots like this. Yes. I don't go all the way up. And a tank top and like some that. short shorts. Honey, get your tank top. We're going with the fanfare, right? This is Jason Albine's kitchen rooftop bar. the city of Nashville and as you can see this is the end of Broadway and this is first street here that runs along like beside Acme feed and seed and hard rock over there and uh, but I'll give you a good I'll give you a view up Broadway Right here, you're looking, you know, directly up Broadway at uh, Honky Tonk Rose, what we call it. That sculpture, a uh, sculpture over there. Not really sure what it is. I don't know the story behind it, but it's been here for several years now. And I, I just don't know much about it, so I shouldn't talk about it, I guess. But anyway, you know what it is, leave a, a comment down below in our comment section. And that's Nissan Stadium across the river. And we're standing at the end of Broadway and First. crossing first street here yeah, the it does say it has the road closed for some reason i guess we've got all kinds of construction going on right here it's like they're here in well the it's from the bombing oh well that makes sense and this is hard rock cafe So, as you can 
see we're still kind of hard for a drop today. Yeah, it's, it's hard to film because the music. I know. You know, we're trying to talk over it. So this is 2nd Avenue where the bombing took place. You want to walk up a little ways? Uh, yeah, see. we can walk up a little ways. Mm -hmm. See, most of the buildings have boards in the windows. It's another new shop. <laughs> they all pretty much have the same stuff. George John. Oh, George is here. But you can see over there. You can get dumpsters outside these businesses. Branches bargain basement. Big boot. Yeah, you can see where it blew all the windows out of these buildings. Yeah, even up. And and there, it's believed that building back there was it that building back there or that one up there? This one over here. That it's believed that. Yeah, it's that building up there. I think that's AT and T or something. It. it Blue the communications. Yeah, it houses yeah, all this a lot of the communications up. for, for you know, the entire southeast, I believe. I don't know. So it, it the bomb was so strong it blew <clears throat> it blew windows and doors out the back of these buildings on the other side yeah, of First uh, Street. <sighs> and it went off where did it go off in you know? I think we're pretty close to where Oh yeah, this is about where it was. This is uh You can see it blew a hole inside of that building. It must have been right up there. Oh yeah. It blew a hole inside of that oh, building. Oh yeah it did. I don't know if they can see that on the camera. Yeah, I don't know if it's showing. But uh yeah. yeah this is as far as it'll let us go. You see BB Kings and Coyote Uglies and Dicks. Last resort. I guess this has really hit them hard, as well as the National Hospital. It's located towards the end of this road here. But anyway, Second Avenue. Yes. And up Commerce, you can see Savaro. We got a. All those places. I'm sure all these places have suffered. I don't know if they're closed right now, but I'm sure they. Yeah. Looks like they might be. Y'all right. Got, got it. Mm -hmm. it, it blew this place down. Oh, and just to point out, right that building right there yeah. Yeah. is CMT. I've done a lot of television shows in there. It blew this place apart. I don't think they received any damage. Probably but, scared the crap out of them, but. <laughs> we can get back down the Broadway yeah. and do the other side. Yes. Wish we had a Segway. Well, yeah, we just strapped the GoPro to the Segway. And yeah. I've never ridden one of you. Taco Bell. Check that out. I've never seen Taco Bell like that. How about that? That's cool. Only in Nashville. <laughs> and it's not open because it got blown out. Oh, yeah. Well, they were right here at Ground Zero. Mm -hmm. Mike's homemade ice cream. She's very closed. Yeah. These poor businesses have really been hit. Yeah. Hit really hard. Them up. You know, first COVID. Yeah. You know, closing mm -hmm. everything down. And then when the can start opening up to, mm -hmm. to limitations. What was this? And some idiot bombs. I'm not sure what that was. Man, it did it, some damage all it the way down the street. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And look, Karen, this and place is on the National Register of Historic Places. Sad. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can see they've got like part of a board up, benchmark. Sad. Big shot. Shot. It's still closed. Uh, distillery. Looks like it might be open. Or trying to open. Yeah. Uh, it looks like it's open. Yeah. Yeah. 
looks like they are in business. And this is Merchants. Or this no, is no, Mercantile, sorry. Mercantile. It's another gift shop. Yeah. All the gift shops are really neat. They're they are. And they, they're really not, I mean, it's, it's, they have their own. Yeah, thing. it's not overpriced, really. I mean, mm -hmm. everything's pretty reasonable, especially right mm -hmm. now. You know, business is trying to get back open. And Honey, I don't really want to say anything, but look, you see, I think, yeah, I really, I think that was Elvis. It was Elvis. Elvis. Well, I he was dead. I think he was Elvis mm. Yeah. I mean, wow. street you players. You see this a lot. Yeah. Let her dry. Let her tears fall down. Like... see a lot of that here. Yeah. And then Redneck, uh, what's this coming up? John Riches. So this is John Riches Redneck Riviera coming up here on the right. a few places <laughs> if the only place that I know of is we can be here at 11.30 in the morning or noon and have all these live bands playing that's a yeah that's a look at first you go here you're gonna get good food we're gonna we're gonna jaywalk we're jaywalking uh, you're not supposed to tell people we're jaywalking Boot country. Boot country. Buy one pair, get two pair free. And how much is the first pair, darling? Uh, like a thousand dollars. Yeah, I'll be. I don't know. I don't know. I don't it's know either. There. We don't know. We're just. Yeah. It's a big boot. <laughs> Check out how big this boot is. Yeah, that's lock that up. It's big. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah. It's a big boot. I know. I can get both of my feet in there. Whiskey bin. You want to walk in there? Ooh. Walk in there. Oh my goodness. Well, look here. Pralines. Candy apples. Candy apples and ducks. Man. Oh my goodness. This is like something you'd see. I love these. Together. Yeah. I mean, they just got everything you can possibly just barrels of candy here. Yeah. Are you feeling? Mm hmm. Valentine's Day candy. Uh, Ooh, look we're at that. past Valentine's. My goodness, a large dumbbell. And thing. we have <laughs> what? Oh, oh my goodness. Big dum dums. Look at the candy apples over here. It's a dum dum. Oh my god. I know. So what's this? Is that like marshmallow or something? Yeah, everything mm -hmm. here looks so great. Yeah, pretzels. Thank you. Thank you. Oh look! Chocolate yeah. guitars. Okay. How about that? Yeah. Every flavor possible. Ice cream. Look at this. Look how pretty it is. <laughs> it's just laid out so pretty. I would imagine that spudge being made. It's about anything you could want. It's like it's a bar that was yet to open. I see the stage, the car, you know, so. In Valentine? Yeah. yeah. Okay. So it's yeah. another place where they have live music. You can see drums in there. They've opened a lot of more places down here since uh, I quit my dinner, didn't I? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So this is where you need to go, I guess, if you, if you want, boots, want some boots or a cowboy hat. And yeah. there are some good deals. And then we're back it's at Jimmy Buffett's Margarita. It's Margarita Bill gift shop. Yes. This is Margarita Bill. You know, I always love his shirts. Yeah, it's 
It's coming to life, people. It's starting to come to life. There's famous Lipscomb University right, right up the road there. And we're we're waiting on the sign to change. You know what? Let's jaywalk. Well, we still gotta cover this. Side. Yeah, I'm saying we're jaywalking. Oh, here. Let's jaywalk. Jaywalk here. We're jaywalking. Don't tell anybody. We're jaywalking. We're jaywalking. Okay, this is Whiskey Row. Dirk Bentley owns this place. Here's the stage. Oh yeah, the stage with my good buddy Vince Marino. And we had such a great band. Yes, you did. It was a great band. He could sing and play. And Anything. Any kind of music. And there's world famous Jack's Barbecue. Oh man, that's world famous right there. Now we're talking. That's gonna be hard for us to That's good time. stuff. Hey, how you doing? Good, how are you? Oh, man, good to see you. Established in 1976. Okay, right here, Robert's West of the World. Yes. This used to be the showroom for Showbud Guitar Company. Wow. From oh, probably the mid 60s up till the about 84, I think. I, the repair shop was upstairs. I spent a lot of time up there when I was a kid. Wow. For those Showbud steel guitar fanatics. This is a lot of history right here. Absolutely. Uh, and it's uh, located right behind the Ryman. The Ryman. Yeah. The alleyway between this, Robert's Western World, and the Opry. Yeah. Runs right behind this building. Any given any given day, me and my dad would come down on the weekends to visit Shot Jackson, who owns Showbud Guitar Company. Wow, how about We'd that? We'd come upstairs to see him and Roy Acuff would pop in and Roy Clark and that's how I got to know all those guys when I was a little boy, you know, 10 or 11 years old. How awesome is that? And that's where I also went Buddy Emmons when I was about 10, 1970. You're going back a, a long time. A long time. A lot of history right here and a lot right of memories here. for me in this building. But anyway, don't want to bore the that? people that don't know anything about steel guitar. But. Well, I think it's interesting whether you do or not. Layla's. How this is Layla's Honky Tonk. I don't know. I don't think you have. I don't think you have. Second fiddle, I played in there once. And that's right here. Second fiddle. And ladies and gentlemen, you're coming up on world famous Tootsie's Honky Tonk. He came over here now. Well, I think it's an impossible. More guitars. This is where uh, Johnny Barber fell out of the picture window playing. Oh. Right this window right here. Oh, this my word. The stage is tiny. I've played here a few times with Vince Marino. So, see this? And this he drum leaned back hit. and fell out the window. The drummer that was playing that night, he just leaned back. Fell out the windows on the news. Bless his art. Okay, let's, That's the legend. Let's take a walk up fifth and look at the rhyme from the outside. Oh, yeah. Good idea. So we're already here. It looks yeah. like these folks are doing some cleaning and painting. Yeah. And, and here's oh, what a nice view. Garth, Miranda, Dolly, George Strait, um, uh, Alan Jackson, Reba McIntyre. Oh, shoot. Merle Haggard, Crystal Gale, Keith Urban, Johnny Cash. He's getting ready to put a couple more people in today. Awesome. Who are you putting in? I'm putting Charlie Pride and uh, Luke Bryan. Oh, oh awesome. Yay, Great, yay, man. Yeah, yeah. Can't wait to see you. Yeah, that's Luke Bryan over there that I missed. Sorry. His name was coming to my mom. Yeah, awesome. So who's this in the background here that shaded out? Yeah, he owns a bunch of this, right? Yeah, yeah. How about that? I used to play down here with a guy named Vince Marino. Oh, yeah? We, it's awesome. We've been four or five years ago. I played here a lot. 
gifts for something. It's just like this, only it's at the other end down there. But you can see it's locked off, and you just walk up those steps. There's one down at the other end. When I was a little boy, Showbud Guitar was right across the alley here, that place we just showed you, yeah. Showbud Still Guitar Place. Yeah. And when I was a little boy, at nighttime, you could come out of the back of Showbud, and I could stand up to the steps and listen to the <laughs> Oh, man. And I could hear all that. But couldn't get up there to see it. How about that? But I heard all that and I thought, you know what? One of these days. One of these days, sure enough. I know it. And this is the. Is this the old entrance? The back? This is. This used was to be the, the main. This was the main entrance. Mm -hmm. To the Ryman. And, and uh, it's a beautiful old building. If you've never been here and never uh, been to the Ryman Auditorium, you should catch it. Yeah. Big piece of history. And Absolutely. It used to be, uh, with all the political changes and the hurt feelings of everybody, they've changed some of the stuff inside, but it used to be the... Uh, yeah. And this is also Martha Bluegrass. Yeah. This started, actually started out as the a father of Bluegrass. tabernacle. So. Mr. Bill Monroe, everybody. He's going to play a little tune here on his, uh, menu. And over here. That's Loretta. <gasps> Miss Loretta. Big bronze Loretta. So anyway. Yeah. Good afternoon, Loretta. Got her guitar. And I'll show you the difference I go in now when we play the room. We love the stained glass windows. Mm -hmm. So if you're on the stage, looking back at the audience, this is what you see you can behind see the, the audience. Yeah. All the stained glass. Yeah, that's a pretty neat place. Mm -hmm. Historically cool since 1892. It's the Mother Church. Country music. It's... it's uh, it used to be a church, right? It, it was built as a church. Uh huh. And this is the entrance I used when I worked. When right I there. Played the Grand Ole Opry down here. Down the okay. right. Which I, you know, they ended all that when COVID came. So. Yeah. I hope all that changes and we can get we back to. We do. Uh, get back to normalcy some way and have shows here. And you walk in this place and smell the popcorn. Mm -hmm. So uh, this is, uh, is this Mr. Hayes or Reverend? Let's take a look. Sir. The I believe so. Where's the line? Thomas Green Ryman, okay. He lived from 1841 to 1904. A prominent riverboat captain and Nashville businessman, Thomas Ryman was known for his generous contributions of time and money to the construction of the Union Gospel Tabernacle. Yes. In 1904, the Tabernacle was renamed the Ryman Auditorium in its honor. There we go. And that's the Ryman. And this is new right here. That's Lula's, that is a good restaurant. It's Cafe Lula. It's really good. I've eaten in there a few times. So, should we head back the way we came? Yeah, can? yeah, I guess go back this way. Yeah. Oh, we'll get Mr. Dickens. Oh, little Jimmy, how little did Jimmy, we our friend almost Mr. Dickens. looked over him? Oh, shoot his plaque. Oh, I'm going to. I love Lovely this man. Lovely human being right there. Love this man. We've been on a 
train ride with him and you played with him at the Opry many times. I've shot him on the Opry. Television, not yeah. camera shot. He would come up to me. I'd be tuning up. He'd come up to me and say, pretty good. Pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> Miss you, Mr. Dickens. Oh, I do too. It's weird that you've worked with all these people in bronze around here, isn't it? Yeah. Me too. Yeah, you have. I have too. You were around many years. She was. Yeah, the, wow. we, we, you know, we were fortunate that we had the best years. Yeah, we were. Nothing against Definitely. all the new kids. We love yeah. them. Hope they're successful. Yeah. But we worked with the pioneers. Absolutely. I miss a lot of them too. Sure miss it. We still country. got a lot of them still around, though. <laughs> yeah, I, I miss yeah. country music. I like too. I miss traditional country music. Yeah. But it's still around in, in different places. Isn't got another big old mountain of snow there <laughs> from plowing? We had a little snow come the other day. More than we usually see. Actually, it was mainly ice. What is the Almost. Shake Shack? Huh? What's the Shake Shack? Oh, I don't know. The Shake Shack. I don't know. Well, pretty, are you about to get hungry? Yeah, I'm tired. Well, let's head to that car. Okay. So we're back, uh, we made a loop. We're back out in front of the Bridgestone where we started. You can see it in the distance there. And I hope you enjoyed our trip. You know? Our little walking tour. I enjoyed it myself. I did too. <laughs> I actually enjoyed seeing the, how much it's, it's not really changed, it's grown. Yeah, it's really grown, for sure. Come across over here. It, well, it's jaywalking. Yeah. But where, where did you want to Jaywalker. Go? I know. Oh, 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 oh. You're the king of jaywalkers. Yep. Okay. So, right. just for just for something to tell you. Uh -huh. Up there at Commerce Street, you can see this is an incline. Uh -huh. I would park up there on Commerce Street uh -huh. and take, bring my Commerce steel guitar. Up, huh? there. up yeah. there at Commerce okay. Street. Yeah. A block down was the garage I parked in. Mm -hmm. When I play, would play down here, I would have to th bring my steel on a two-wheel dolly, which weighs 100 pounds, mm -hmm. an amp and a seat down here, down all the way down this block, and truck it over there to one of those to bars. To the Ryman, or to the bars, yeah. The bar. Yeah. The Ryman, they did give you a little better place to park, wouldn't they? Oh, yeah. The Ryman's pretty nice. Yeah. And you got stage hands helping you. Yeah, that's always so that's time, always great. One time I was playing over at Crossroads where you seen early in the video. And I was able to drop my stuff off at the door in front of the place and go park. And I went to come back and pick my stuff up and they closed the streets. <laughs> so I had to carry it. I had no dolly or nothing. I had to carry it to make two trips up this street with Oh Lord! That's probably how I tore my and going there, back so. that way is a haul, yeah. and I've made that many times working uh, here, uh, like the CMAs and stuff, That's like probably... at the end of the night, and you're carrying everything you've hauled in all week back to the car with you. That's probably what messed up my shoulder. <laughs> yeah, probably so. But anyway, here we are back at Smashville, Bridgestone Arena. Anyway, we sure hope. Let me turn this camera around and we'll say bye to everybody. Hey, thanks for watching, everybody. We sure hope you enjoyed our little walk through Nashville downtown. Yeah, we and, uh, uh, we had requests to do this, and we've got requests to do other things, <laughs> but we're going to keep on vlogging. <laughs> yeah. We've had requests, but we're going to go on yes. anyway. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. Please hit subscribe. Subscribe to our channel, and you'll see more stuff. We, we got a lot of stuff planned and for the future, and the, yes, we do. the channel's growing. Really appreciate y'all's support because it's 
it, it's fun to us and uh, it's, yeah. it's it, it, Let's if, if it makes, you're interested. <laughs> yeah and if it makes somebody happy out of there you know if you see something that you didn't know or you know you're thinking about coming to Nashville or some of the places and things we do it might give you a little help and insight on what what to expect yes but yeah, if you'll subscribe and hit that notification bell and smash all those buttons and <laughs> click on everything, that'd be great. Yes, thank you for watching, everybody. Thanks. We really appreciate you. Bye-bye.